response. No comment from the city of Fort Pierce and the police department after losing a sexual discrimination lawsuit to the tune of half a million dollars. WPBF 25 News' John Zanita spoke to the police chief today and has the story all new at 6. Fort Pierce's new police chief declined to comment on this lawsuit, but she did tell us that this is a new administration and that the whole climate of the police department is changing under her new leadership. The new chief promised change was coming from the top down. New leadership, new attitude, and sensitivity training for her officers. I think our relationship with the community is changing. I think that every day we're doing good and great things. The chief and the city did not want to talk about a sexual discrimination lawsuit. A former police sergeant just won more than half a million dollars in damages, claiming the police department was a hostile work environment where she was harassed for being a woman and demoted for filing complaints. The chief who was in charge at the time is gone. Others have retired. But WPBF 25 News has learned there are still some supervisors mentioned in the lawsuit who are still on staff, including a female lieutenant who allegedly spread rumors that the plaintiff was sleeping with male officers. The city manager also declined to comment on losing the lawsuit, and it's unclear what, if any, further action the city might take. The half million dollars in damages will likely be covered by insurance. Reporting in Fort Pierce, John Zetas, WPBF 25 News.